currently being called as the world's largest purpose-built air-conditioned riding facility. Here inside we have an approximate 6,000 seats uh, for spectators and uh, we have a fairly large field of flavor as we can pull most of the uh, equine uh, disciplines uh, and range competitions. However, this uh, 5,300 square meters of footprint allows us also to pull other kind of events. And we already made an exercise and we identified 24 other sports, lacrosse and uh, even the Harlem Globetrotters, we, we hope that they will someday come and perform as a show. So from handball to basketball to lacrosse, we will hope, we will hope that we will have a chance to, to uh, pull some events. And there's another feature which we might highlight, which can be uh, some of your interest. Since you are performing on special footing, special tracks, the Mondo, isn't it? So horses, they do require also special uh, footing and track, which is here. People might consider or call it as a normal sand, but the proper name is Provax. This is a special mixture of sand, geotextile fibers and wax and different uh, very secret things and this this provides the horses the same good performing surface as it is required for uh, human athletes in the track and field uh, especially in the track uh, uh, events there is another very uh, important advantage of this uh, surface is that this is a really low maintenance this means that we have to water it once and then we will leave it for three years and you can imagine under these climatic conditions this can save us a lot uh, and what else you have to know about this surface this Provax is completely the same and identical as it is going to be used at the London Olympic London Olympics this summer so the same company brought it for us and we purchased the same what they will put for the London Olympics this summer okay uh, some words about the structure and the, the the function of this performance arena you might have seen this huge, huge dome over the uh, uh, spanning over the field of plays. One thing we have to be very proud of, I do believe that you are more or less familiar with the Aspire Dome, isn't it? The, the very nice multi-functional hall. Ours is 40 meters bigger. Okay, okay. so <laughs> mark my word, ours is 40 meters bigger, so that's it's uh, very important. So, uh, jokes apart. The facility has three major sections with three field of plays. This is the indoor arena, which I uh, already explained to you. We have an outdoor arena, which is a full football pitch size. So we also entertain the idea that in 2022 we offer with an artificial turf as a training facility for the football teams if they want. And we have also a covered warm-up arena. All the three areas have the identical and same footing as you can see here because as per regulations we have to uh, provide it. What you see in front of yourself, this is a so-called grandstand. The grandstand has four levels, we just approach through uh, the ground level. The first level is let's say the uh, spectators concourse and the area. Through those doors and the 